All right, hello again. This is Echo Craft. Um, so today I purchased, well, I purchased it a couple of days ago and I got it today. I did end up getting the Beat Run. Um, this is the Beat Run heavy duty uh, microphone arm stand. And uh, we're gonna crack this puppy open and here we go. So this is the one that I talked about, uh, toner uh, arm, which I have set up behind me. And I'll have to show it to you in a minute. But right now I'm gonna just unbox this. Yeah, so the toner one is 18 inches long and I like the length on that because it comes right in the middle of the desk. And this one is, I believe, 15 inches. Oh, look, it comes with, uh, it comes with cable ties. Yeah, just like the uh, toner one did. These are a little bit thinner. The toner ones are a lot thicker, as you can see. Uh, but yeah, so we're gonna try these out. This is really nice, really gorgeous. Look at this, wow. This is really, really nice. Let's get that knife open again. This guy. So this is very spring-loaded. Um, this is made, wow, that really springs open, huh? Um, so yeah, so this is the one that I was talking about and I said, this is really nice. Let's see, let's get one of these and try it out. And this one comes with a really nice, um, let me put this down here for a minute. This comes with a nice base as well. The headphone hanger uh, actually sits in front. I'm gonna get this out of the bag. And there we go. Yeah, so this is pretty cool. Um, pretty solid. Doesn't look uh, janky. Oh, this moves. Oh, look at that. So this is, uh, this is pretty nice. This has a nice rubber bottom on it as well, or top I should say, that actually fits on the desk. Yeah, the headphone thing's made out of plastic. Okay, well, I thought it was metal. And it's got a knob here to adjust, as you can see. Um, pretty decent base, just like the toner. Uh, but yeah, so let's give it a shot. I'm actually gonna set it up. Uh, probably set it up right next to the toner. There it is right here. So yeah, so I'm gonna set it up, see what happens and we'll go from there. Okay, as you can see, I actually assembled it. I, there's a lot of finagling going on. So on the bottom, um, here's the manual right here. Uh, you can see that, sorry, I'm out of frame. Here's the manual right here. Um, yeah, so I had to take a Phillips uh, head screwdriver here and adjust the tension on the bottom arm and I'll show you what that looks like. So on the bottom arm, there's this screw right here, where is it? Right there, um, that you basically can tighten or loosen. So I actually had to loosen it to get it where I wanted. Once I put it in, and I have this little locking screw here, which is really nice. It's really cool because it doesn't swing fast I got it to stay where I wanted it, and I'll show you in a minute. Just bring it up a little bit so you can see the arm. And so this is it here. Let me zoom out a little bit. So there it is. Um, it's pretty nice, it's pretty solid. And here's the toner one. They're both very nice. They're both very nice, very solid. Uh, the toner one has a little bit more flexibility to it because I can move this any way I want. This guy, once it's set up, and it's stiff. So you really can't do much with it unless I loosen it. And that's about it. It's, it's pretty much where it is. It stays where it is. Uh, I haven't put the microphone on it yet. I kind of I kind of like the toner one because I can move it out of my way. I can bend it any way I want. Um, so the toner one's nice. This looks really sharp, as you can see. Um, yeah, uh, they're both very nice. The beat the beat run is real nice. It's uh, it's, it's 
solid metal. Um, the, the fittings and everything here are plastic. It's got brass fittings here for the microphone. Um, and it's got this really nice base too with the headphone hanger. If you can see the headphone hanger here, um, which is kind of cool. Um, so yeah, it's, it's nice. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it though. I, I kind of like the tone arm, a toner arm. Um, it's just, it's more flexible, I guess. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's gonna be quite the decision, but they're both very nice. This, this is more flexible because you can bend it a little bit differently. Um, as you can see, as I can move it up like this if I want to, get it out of the way, I can bring it like this. The beat run uh, doesn't really let you do that. Uh, unless I loosen everything. And once I loosen everything, it, it tends to um, float up. So that's why I had to use the uh, Phillips head and on the bottom adjust the tension, which is great. Uh, I don't know. It's, it's going to be a tough choice. I like this a lot. I like the way it looks. It's very sleek as I step back and look at it. It's a very sleek looking uh, boom on uh, where the toner is kind of that old school look. And, and but you know, sometimes, you know, the old school way of doing things is better, I guess. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know. Uh, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I do like the beat run. It looks very sleek. Um, but I'm glad I, I got both of them because I wanted to compare the two. It's hard to do that when you're looking at YouTube videos, you're on Amazon, and you're looking at uh, the different ones, and you're like, you can't really see them, touch them, feel them. so. And there's really no place around here that sells this stuff, so I couldn't go into a store and just, you know, uh, check out this stuff. And But here it is. It also has this channel uh, to run the cable down, which I thought was kind of nice. Um, yeah, so maybe I should hook the mic up to it and see what I think. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. I don't know what to do. I'm going to think about it. But what, let me know in the comments what you guys think. It, it, it's Beat Run. This was uh, $50 on Amazon. The Tonar was $46, I believe. Um, and then there was also, I have this one here. This is the original one that I bought. Uh, this is the 13 inch arm. This is smaller, obviously. Uh, but this is the one that had the broken screw. I fixed it, I kept it. Well, Tonar told me to keep it because it was broken. Uh, again, I like this one. I'm thinking of using this one for a camera. Um, I don't, I don't know what to do. <laughs> it's very hard. The decision's very hard because this is nice. Uh, yeah. This didn't come with anything fancy. Didn't come with a pop filter. Didn't come with a windscreen. Uh, did, it only came with the cable ties that say beat run on them. Um, yeah. But I, I think it's nice, but I don't know. I, I think this is really nice. I just don't know if uh, I'm going to keep it because I just like the flexibility of the tone arm. Look at that. Um, interesting. Anyway, Beat Run, Boom Arm, 50 bucks on Amazon. Tonar, Boom Arm, $46 on Amazon. I believe that one's $39 or $36, a 13 inch. Check them out. I'm gonna try to make a decision. Maybe you guys, like I said, if you let me know in the comments. I, I don't know, I'm very undecided right now. <laughs> All right. Stay creative, peace, and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you like what I do. All right?